Hey guys, it's Kirby. Today's DIY is a bath salt. This makes the perfect gift, and I'm gonna show you how to make it right now. So, here's what you'll need. Epsom salt, sea salt, baking soda, essential oil of your choice, an empty wine bottle, gloves, lavender flower, and rosemary. The first step is just to mix all of your dry ingredients together. So we're going to take three cups of Epsom salt with two cups of sea salt and then add one cup of baking soda. Epsom salt is great at relieving stress. It's full of magnesium and fun fact, when you get stressed out, it depletes your magnesium and replaces it with adrenaline. So this is just gonna help to really soothe you, calm you down, and it's great for inflammation. So if your joints ache or maybe your feet hurt, Use some Epsom salt. Sea salt is actually really great if you have an irritation or an infection. It's also been known to help with body acne. Baking soda is really great for your skin. It's calming, it also helps with irritations, and it helps balance the pH of your skin. All right, next, add an essential oil of your choice. I'm going with lavender for essential oil. And now, this is actually the really fun part, you wanna color your salt. Now, you can easily just grab some food coloring. I want mine to be purple or lavender and you can mix them together and you'll be good to go. But I actually have soap coloring, which works perfect for bath salts. So I heat it up a little bit on a hot plate. If you do decide to use food coloring, be sure to put on gloves so that it doesn't stain your hands. And if you're wondering, okay, if it'll stain my hands, will it stain me in the tub? No, it won't. The water will dilute it, so you don't have to worry about getting stained. You just wanna put your hands in, start mixing it, and really just massage it so it breaks up all the clumps and gets a nice, pretty pastel color. All right, so I have massaged this. It looks good. It's a really pretty blush pink, which I'm not mad at. From here, we're going to chop up our rosemary. Rosemary is so soothing, and when you put this in your bathtub with your bath salts, it's gonna give you this nice spa feel. So you wanna chop it up very finely. Be careful. And the reason why you want it to be so fine is because it'll be easier to funnel into your wine bottle. All right, now it's time to fill up this bottle. I'm gonna put a few lavender flowers in the bottom. I might put a few sprigs of the rosemary as well. And then I'm just gonna set it inside my big bowl and start scooping away. Okay, so I just filled up my wine bottle and as I was filling it up with the salt, I dispersed a little bit of the lavender flower just so it has a really nice decorative flair. How cute is that? And then to package it up, you just keep that cork and stick it right in. Now, if you're giving these away as party favors or even gifts, all you need is some twine and a cute little tag. You can write their names on it and you're good to go. I'm Kirby, and we'll see you next time on Pop Sugar Beauty.